Moving to Overwatch. And hopefully nobody will kill her. Just hunk her down again. Alright, so our cover is definitely a little bit crappier now, but That's the bench will have to do, I guess. Is he out of ammo too? Locked and loaded. Moving. Alright, we're almost in the safe down. zone. Moving. I'm on it. Righty, and finally, I think we should be able to just rush these last couple people down here. So I'm gonna put the woman that we need to rescue on that Heading bench, that I location. think. Hopefully that car is done doing Overwatch whatever it's doing. And whoop bam. Can we all just run now? Yes, sir. Let's make sure the VIP makes it actually first. Thank you. Oh my god. Thank you so much. Well that Execute went pretty well to the too. Strike one. Get back here on the double. I'm pleased. I am pleased. We have not lost anybody yet. I'm sure we we're going to. There's definitely going to be cases where we will. These are all easy, but I expected to be losing people left and right right off the bat, so I guess if we just take it easy and think things through, it's not that bad at this level. It's going to get worse, I'm sure. Alright, we got some promotions out of that. Somebody, oh, People are wounded again. People and they're getting wounded. Okay, so bullet swarm. Firing primary weapon in the first action no longer ends a turn. Well, that's probably not a bad thing. Suppressing enemies also... Hmm. Let's go... Let's go with this one. Confirm. Our snipers specialize in dealing massive amounts of damage from afar, but without sufficient training, they're vulnerable in close combat situations. Sounds pretty normal. Just like it sounds, the support class provides that intangible edge our squads need. They make everyone around them better. Alright, cool. They're not rookies anymore. We got a bunch of corpses. Alrighty. Remember, we will be watching. I'm sure you will. Alright, so let's go... I can't go to any of these places. I have to go to the situation where I have no Commander, choice anyway. good news. The Council has donated a satellite. Our current satellite uplink facility can support up to two satellites. So I recommend we launch the new one immediately. Alright. So I get to choose where to launch this? There isn't one over the United States already? Are you kidding me? Can I go to another place? Nope, I guess it has to be the United States, doesn't it? Fine. I don't... Oh, no. We can do something else. So, they, th this one... The United States is already covered. I gotcha. So, they do, they do $100. Really? They're giving me 50 bucks? It's kind of worthless. Probably go for somebody who's most... Why does Nigeria give so much money? That's odd. That's very odd. Well, let's just go for North America, I guess, first. Canada gives more money, so... Yeah, that sounds good. With this additional satellite in place, we've gained a significant upgrade to our overall coverage. I recommend we begin scanning for alien contacts right away. Oh god, something happened. You're telling me that we should risk the lives of our troops so we can take one of these things alive. Yes. 
Without a live specimen, I'm afraid we've reached the pinnacle of what my team is able to accomplish. And how do you suggest we do this, Doctor? The autopsy I've just completed confirms that the alien's physiology is quite similar to our own. A highly concentrated electrical current delivered at close range should cause neuro... Close range? And what happens if it doesn't work? Do you really think this is worth the risk? I do. We do not know our enemy. How can we hope to stop something that we do not understand? If we can capture one of these creatures alive, we may be able to communicate with it. I'm gonna lose and somebody over this. I can tell you that right now. Find out what they want. Where they're operating from. Yes. That possibility outweighs all risks, in my opinion. I can construct a safe enough facility to house our captive, but I do not know how we could possibly communicate with it. Not to worry. I will see to that. All right. I'll speak to the commander. I'm here. I could hear all that, you know. All right, let's assign some more research here. Capture a live alien. Oh, man. Commander, based on Dr. Valen's report, I recommend we begin researching the new weapon she's calling the Arc Thrower in the labs. Once completed, we can send the plans down to engineering for fabrication, and then equip one of our troops with it in the barracks. Dr. Shen and the engineering team are also waiting on approval for construction of the containment facility that we'll need in order to house the alien captive. Commander to engineering. Commander to engineering. Commander. No doubt you are aware of Dr. Valen's request to capture one of the aliens. A sound plan, but she fails to realize that we lack a facility to safely contain a live specimen. With your approval, my team and I will begin construction of a suitable facility. All right, so build facilities, I would assume. What do we got here? Build facility, satellite uplink. I can't do that stuff yet, so... Alien containment priority. Thank you, Commander. I'll let you know when the facility is ready. Dr. Valen has asked to see you, Commander. No doubt she wishes to explain her plan personally. How personally? Commander to the research labs. Commander to the re Commander, I'm sure you've been briefed on my request. With your authorization, we can begin research on the arc thrower immediately. Well, I don't really have a lot of choice in this matter, do I? So let's do it. Commander to mission control. Commander to mission control. Hold on, I want to do something here. Let us buy a couple more med kits here. Alrighty, and... Commander to mission control. Commander to... Commander. We're picking up widespread radio chatter indicating UFO sightings within our current satellite coverage area. We should begin scanning for contacts as soon as possible. All right, do it to it. it looks like that satellite we launched paid off. We're picking up an unidentified fast mover. If we scramble an interceptor now, we may be able to take it down. All right. Raven Two sounds better. Uh oh, they're the same. They're just it's Raven One and Raven Two. Okay. Launch Raven One. I don't care. How the heck is this gonna work? Do I have to do anything or is it just gonna do it on its own? It looks like it's just gonna do it on its own. We have eyes on the bandit. Wow. Oh no. My little ship's not doing well. Okay. That was, uh. I guess it's a little tougher than the alien ship is. We have a confirmed kill on Bogey 001. I repeat, the UFO is down. I'll copy, over. Solid copy, Voodoo 37. Nice work. Central out. All right, people. Retask Recon Satellite Bravo and get me a visual on that crash site. She's coming into range now, sir. On screen. Magnify.
still in one piece. Well, that's handy Commander, dandy. I recommend we get a strike team to the crash site immediately. Maybe we can capture an alien there if one survived the crash too. That might not that might actually work out. Okay, so 